What's up, Hammerheads? Welcome back to the channel. It's been a minute, so I figured I better do an update video. So, if any of you have been around for any period of time, you know this car. It was a good car. Yes, I said was. And it's a pretty car. I was just getting this thing ready for car show season. It was going to go to a friend to get some paint work done, hopefully. It's going to slam it on my coilovers, which I already have. I've had the coilovers for years. They just never made it on the car. God, it's a pretty car. Uh-oh. What happened to that fender? That doesn't look good. Oh. Oof. Yeah. Some bonehead and an F-150 rear-ended us like a jag-off. Full bed full of tools he had ladder racks toolboxes thing was overweight clapped out rusty piece of junk f-150 and as you can imagine that quarter panel not cheap to replace hatch pushed in trunk pushed in bumper crash support everything under the car is all pushed in yes it could be fixed but it's more money in my opinion than this car's worth so she's going down the road the car was already in our title so you can't double our title so i guess that's good <laughs> but uh i got a guy coming to look at it today so one more walk around the old girl got a lot of good parts on it it's a good car hopefully someone can make a really really nice parts car out of this or you know rebuild it if someone could do the work themselves, it would be worth it. It just isn't worth it to me. So, we're going to walk away from that car. We're going to walk over to the garage because I already got a rebound car. <laughs> 2011 Audi A5. Yes, it's a Gen 1. E80, EA888 motor, and they had issues, but this one's already been fixed by the factory. Uh, so Wickley Audi already did a bunch of repairs on this car. New pistons. Former owner did a uh, water pump. All the chains, everything associated with making these cars reliable. So, this is the new whip. More on that to come. It is a base model. I seem to have a thing with buying base model cars. I don't know if I like that. But interior is pretty clean. Like I said, it's a base model, so it doesn't have all the fancy, all the fancy buttons and gizmos right here. It's got the little screen right up there. That's okay. It's got the base model seats, but that can be upgraded. But all in all, my car's pretty clean. Got a little dent in the door which it's right let's see right there the camera will barely pick it up as you guys know i'm very very upfront on all these videos she's got a couple scuffs and dings bumpers got a scuff there this rocker panel i don't know if you guys can even see it this rocker panel has got a few dents and gouges. Whoa, there it goes. There's a scuff on the rear bumper. Not this side, other side. So, yeah, scuff. But all in all, 85,000 miles on the rig. And to me, I've always thought this was a very, very sexy platform. Very nice looking car. So, that's going to be the new project. We're going to be doing videos on that thing now, hopefully. So, just like I said, a little update video, letting you guys know where I've been, as if any of you care. Let me get some good lighting. My sister-in-law draws horses everywhere because she's a weirdo. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, little update video, little change of pace. Unfortunately, I really hate to see the Avant uh, go. It was a good car. It's a well-sorted car. 
but things happen and you know you move on so got the new whip and i'm excited to wrench on that i'll see you guys next time